Right. America will be watching today as Supreme Court nominee Brett Kavanaugh testifies on Capitol Hill, along with the first woman to accuse him of sexual misconduct. Here this morning are Republican strategist Jackie Bally and Democratic strategist Dallas Jones. Good morning to you both Good and morning. thanks for being here. Good thanks morning. for having us. Okay, now we know that Dr. Christine Blasey Ford plans to say Politico published a transcript of her statement. In it, she says that... In 1982, Brett Kavanaugh held his hand over her mouth while trying to take her clothes off. She goes on to say, quote, It was hard for me to breathe, and I thought that Brett was accidentally going to kill me. She says the assault, quote, drastically altered my life. For a very long time, I was too afraid and ashamed to tell anyone the details. When the senators hear this, what do you think their reaction is going to be? Well, I, I do want her to her story to be told because any woman who uh, is going through anything needs to be told. But I also feel that Judge Kavanaugh needs to go through a legal process, the due process, and uh, Democrats in particular have pretty much already said he's guilty. Uh, they have gone on air to say that. Many in mainstream media have said that. And they have not allowed Judge Kavanaugh due process. The Constitution says innocent until proven guilty. When you're talking about something that happened 30 something years ago, it is very difficult to prove if he's innocent or if he's guilty. It's more of he say, she say, and whoever comes out of there more believable, that's where the senators will go. And keep in mind, Judge Kavanaugh has gone through six different FBI background checks and investigations, six, to get to the point that he is on the current court, which is one of the highest in the country, and nothing has ever come up. Okay, l let's get past the politics. In 1991, when Anita Hill accused then Supreme Court nominee Clarence Thomas of wrongdoing and sexual m misconduct, there was an, a, an investigation by the FBI. Three women, three women have come out and accused Brett Kavanaugh of, of, of sexually assaulting them. This is not 1991. This is 2018. And in this time, the Me Too movement is real, and that is what is on trial today in, in, a, in a Senate where Republicans have chosen to set a vote for tomorrow morning before even having the decency to listen to this woman speak out. I am the father of a daughter. This woman deserves to be heard. The other two women deserve to be heard. There ought to be an investigation. Politics ought to be rejected. This is the Supreme Court. This is the highest standard of our values in our country. And if we are just going to continue to allow the same thing, what does it all mean? I'm glad my colleague got to talk first because I was interested in what she had to say about this subject. But for me, I, 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 it's, it's, not about, it's not about the politics of it. These women deserve to be heard and there ought to be an investigation. I think we're okay, forgetting now, the wait, role wait, of let the Let me Senate. ask a question, let me ask a question. Sure. This morning, we have the news of two men who said that it, it wasn't Kavanaugh, it was it was us. We're the ones who, who did the these sexual assault. Which now, again goes uh, to my point. Well, but and do, goes to mind do, we, do we charge these occurred. individuals or not? Well, the role of the Since Senate... Since they're admitting to doing something the that is totally illegal? The role of the illegal. Senate is to advise and consent. That is the role of the Senate. Different investigations that could occur if a crime has occurred has to happen with the FBI. Hence why I brought up the FBI has already looked at Kavanaugh six different times prior to this. Prior this to is not, this. This is not the role of of the Prior Senate. To the this. role of the Senate is to advise and consent on his capabilities as a judge, and, and, which has been proven in the last and Jackie, 36 they advised years. And, and as a mother of, of sons, mm -hmm. I do want due process because I don't want women thinking you can just say someone did something and then not have due process follow through. And all I'm going to say is in 1991, the Senate did their job of advising and consenting with the FBI investigating the allegations of Anita Hill when a black man was nominated for the Supreme Court. And I think, while we have three women, not one, that there ought to be an FBI investigation into their allegations. Now, if there are men that came out and said it wasn't him, it was us, the point is it still ties it all together and sexual misconduct occurred and it ought to be investigated. We're gonna have to leave it right there and we will see whether the investigation does pop up. But today, a lot of folks are going to be looking at that Senate committee hearing. Yes. 10 past 7 a.m. and be sure to stay